Hi, I'm Christina Ortiz. If you live by the coast and you're tired of seagulls rubbing your foot with the confidence of a cousin reading your fridge, I have good news for you. Science has finally given you permission to yell at these birds. A team of researchers from the University of Exeter took a tour of nine towns in England, clipboards and snacks in hand. Their mission was to figure out how to stop seagulls from stealing lunch and treating the beach like an all-you-can-eat buffet they never paid for. For this study, researchers placed a Tupperware full of fries and waited for the gulls to approach. Then they played one of three audio tracks. Option 1. A man yelling, No! Stay away! That's my food! Option 2. The exact same phrase, but said like a normal human being. Option 3. A sweet chill robin singing. Uh, basically, nature's elevator music. Almost half the gulls took off the moment they heard the shouting. The normal voice only made them back away, <laughs> like avoiding a noisy neighbor. And the robin song? 70% of the gulls stayed right there, probably thinking, oh, nice vibe, thanks. But here's the twist. All the recordings had the same volume, so the birds were not reacting to loudness but how the men spoke. This means seagulls can pick up on tone. The researchers weren't trying to ignite a federally war war. The birds are hungry like the rest of us. The whole point was to show you don't need to go overboard to keep your lunch from becoming shared. A calm chat might make a goal reconsider, but if you want instant results, go full dramatic and shout. Totally science approved. Remember, seagulls Judge every syllable, raise your voice, guard your fries, and enjoy the tiny but glorious victory of protecting your lunch.